It's trailer time with Christopher Nolan's new th action thriller, Inception. Now, I've heard a lot about this movie before I even saw the trailer. Before I even saw the trailer, I knew it was one of my most anticipated movies of 2009. Now, first off, you got Christopher Nolan, an all-star cast, Leonardo DiCaprio, an amazing freaking actor. We have some Ellen Page, Joseph Gordon-Levitt, Jay Loves, and then we have, I heard there was rumor that Michael Caine was going to be in it somewhere. All we really know about this movie, because the teaser trailer is just a teaser, it doesn't really give you any plot, just show you, shows you some footage. The only thing we really know is that it's about some CAO type guy who's involved with a blackmail scandal, so it's like, apparently it's a crime thriller, but Christopher Nolan, he's putting a twist on it yet again. But we'll talk more about his style and how it works in this movie after you guys take a look at the trailer, so uh, here it is. Holy freaking crap, right? Okay, first off, I know what you're thinking. What the hell? But at the same time, you're like, oh my god. And that's how everybody's describing it. Because when I first saw it, I was like, alright, what's going on? You don't know what's going on. You really, you have no idea. But that's what makes it so intriguing. You have no idea what's going on, but you're still so interested. That's what works so much about this trailer, or teaser at least. I mean, at first I thought people were going to be mad because it was like that, but no, it's just more intriguing to everybody. Now, first off, Christopher Nolan's taking some crime thriller kind of genre, you know, that's been boiled down and used over and over again to the same exact formula. But he always adds some like, twist of it, like in Memento, he added the twist of having it out of chronological order and telling it backwards and have it be about um, a guy with amnesia. And he's even, he even took a superhero genre and twisted that into somewhat of a crime drama. Now, Christopher Nolan can always add a great twist on something, and I don't mean a gay Omnite Shyamalan twist. I mean, he can always add just a little something different there. So, in this trailer, you see a couple little close-ups of Leonardo DiCaprio's face and some cool taglines. But then, you know, you see, you see something that's out of the ordinary, which is something I, I noticed on the second or third viewing of the trailer. Like, you see the glass where it's tilted, so you know everything, something's going on with gravity here, you don't know what's going on. And then you see um, people like flipping around and stuff, it looks like a matrix. But I mean, this trailer just gets you so pumped up. It's like Inception. Like now, the only thing I have to say about it is like when I heard the the uh, music or the score behind it, it kind of reminded me of that Transformers robot kind of noise. And then when it did the zoom out of the city that spelled the title, that reminded me of the Terminator Salvation trailer. It's it's nothing against the trailer. It's just that's kind of what I thought of when I saw it. I don't know about you. Well, Leonardo DiCaprio really has never had a bad role. I mean, even if he's had a bad role, he just makes it work to perfection. So I'm not worried about anything about the acting because, you know, Leonardo DiCaprio can do anything. He has such a great range. And apparently so does Christopher Nolan. He can go all over the place. I mean, from The Prestige to Memento to Batman. This guy, you know, he's like a modern Martin Scorsese, personally to like summer blockbusters, and he's, that's what he's going to become because he can take such an easy blockbuster premise and just make it so intriguing and so amazing and make it more than just an average blockbuster. So Inception looks just so great. I'm not exactly sure what it's going to be. I'm a, I rate this completely different as a t teaser trailer. If this was all we get, if this is all we get up until the movie comes out, then that's kind of disappointing. But I think there will be a good trailer um, where we actually see more. You know, it's just a little teaser trailer to get you hyped up, and boy, does it do the work. So this trailer, I think I'm going to give a 9 out of 10. 
So Christopher Nolan's Inception looks freaking amazing. We all need to check it out when it comes out July 16th next summer. I mean, it's up there with Iron Man 2 and Toy Story 3 for my most anticipated of next summer. Okay, so that's Inception. Leonardo DiCaprio, Christopher Nolan together. Oh my god, what a great tag team. See you guys. That was the Inception trailer review.